There's a new word that has ingrained itself into the Chinese lexicon, and the word is water army. It's used to describe a group of internet commenters who are either pay for or works with an organization to flood the internet with either positive comments or negative comments with the aim to sway public opinion. Now, for the past couple of years, many Chinese internet users thought that the rather immoral practice of recruiting and using water armies on the internet was a practice only seen in China. But it seems the American government is also utilizing the strategy. According to a Weibo post that cites Reuters, White House officials quickly began to fire off a barrage of Twitter tweets to defend President Obama's health care program after NBC aired an unflattering report that suggested Obama had misled the public about his health care law. The article from Reuters points out that staffers were trained by the White House Counsel's Office on what they could and could not say on social media, and that the White House's Twitter army is the lead player in an intense war of messaging on social media, which is capable of swiftly knocking down negative news reports. Now, Chinese Weibo users are very familiar with this tactic, so let's take a look at what they had to say. Spending taxpayer money to hire a water army, and even so, Obama still can't turn public opinion in his favor. What a disastrous second term. I want to say that the water army employed by the White House is really professional. When I was studying in the U.S., they would constantly send me messages. I wonder how much the White House pays for their water army, but my guess is that it must be more expensive than Chinese water armies. If this continues to develop, I wonder if professional comment posters would become a good career. This is a smart move. The internet offers the government a direct channel to interact with their citizens. There is no better way to send out propaganda. How to properly utilize new media is going to be an important lesson that all governments need to learn. China's Weibo also became very successful to the current Chinese administration. For example, Weibo is used a lot in the fight against corruption, and it helps to expose social problems at the roots. I hope that China's Weibo can also become a way for the Chinese government to reach out to the common masses. Professional water army companies in China, often marketed as internet marketing companies, operate on murky legal grounds. And many of these companies in China have been found to be in violation of cyber defamation laws. A 2010 news story from China Central Television showed that many of these so-called marketing companies offered a range of rather questionable services. It includes promotion of a product, company, person or message, slander against a competitor, and the ability to delete negative reviews, posts or even news articles. Price to buy positive reviews and messages cost as little as 80 cents for a thousand basic zombie commenters or as much as $20 for an A-level zombie, which is an account with the characteristics of a real person, with photos, self-descriptions, tags, and their own zombie fans. Now, just a couple of weeks ago, China conducted a crackdown against internet rumor mongering, and some of the more prominent water army companies were closed down, and many arrests were made.